Hey, what's up, everybody? Welcome back to another video with the Roshank Redemption, and today I've got another episode of Shoutout Sunday for you guys, a series that's dedicated to helping some of the smaller YouTubers out there to grow their channels. Quickly though, before getting into the video, I'd like to apologize if the commentary is below my normal standards, because I am feeling pretty sick at the moment, but that's not going to stop me from recording today's episode, because on a personal level, this series means a lot to me. I would go so far as to say that Shoutout Sunday is one of the most important series on my channel, and I say this for two main reasons. First of all, given how awesome of a community I have, and how amazing my viewers and supporters are, really the least I can do to give back both to my community and the larger YouTube community as a whole is by doing this series. And secondly, I totally understand how difficult it is to become successful on YouTube. I've been there pumping out videos every day, pouring my heart and soul into making content, and just not seeing my channel grow as much as I would like. As such, I feel as though Shoutout Sunday is a great way for me to help some of the smaller YouTubers out there to grow their channels. Next, I'd like to give you guys a quick update on my channel here. Yesterday, as per usual, I released another Fallout 4 analysis video, which I put quite a bit of work into researching and gathering the information for that video. And as always, there's absolutely no obligation to check it out and it's not going to hinder your chance of getting a shout in any manner but nonetheless if you could take a glance at it and give me some feedback that would mean the world to me also i apologize that this whole me advertising my fallout for news video is sort of becoming a weekly deal if you guys want me to stop discussing things like this on shout sunday then i feel like that's totally understandable so let me know what you think of all of this in the comments and if you'd like me to stop i would be more than happy to Finally, before getting into the shoutouts themselves, I want to once again reiterate the criteria I use to judge who gets these shoutouts each week. And just to clarify, it's not enough to just satisfy these requirements, I will choose those who best satisfy them to be the winners each week. The four criteria are as follows. 1. You need to have a consistent and regular uploading schedule within reason. 2. You need to be a hard worker which I will judge by looking at the effort and little details that you put into your videos. 3. You need to be dedicated to your community, reply to comments, and care for your viewers and supporters. Fourth, and this is the most important of the characteristics, you need to stay active on my Shoutout Sunday series and check out the YouTubers that I shout out to each week. Okay folks, and with that, I'd say it's about time to get started with the shoutouts here. And first up on the shout list today is a channel by the name of Sir Trucker Livingston. And the first thing I have to say about Sir Trucker Livingston's channel is that he has a very consistent uploading schedule and has quite a bit of variety on his channel, which in my opinion speaks to how hard a worker he is overall. It's very clear that Livingston really cares about his YouTube channel and as such puts a lot of effort into maintaining it and making it better. Now as for the specific content on Sir Trucker Livingston's channel, he does a ton of different things, ranging from Pokemon to very simulators to vlogs and other stuff of that nature which as I said adds a ton of variety to his channel and regardless of what you like this guy's probably got something that you will enjoy so as such I highly recommend giving Sir Truck a living his channel a look. Second up on the shout list for this week is a YouTuber by the name of Tamarliel or Tamara and what stood out to me most about Tamara's channel and considering her for a shout is how much she truly cares for her community and her supporters. She replies to virtually every single comment she gets and is always very pleasant and nice when talking to your viewers. She also has a very consistent uploading schedule which is essentially daily right now and as such is an exemplary candidate for this channel. Now as for specific content, Tamara does a great job of mixing things up. She does things that range from The Sims, to Elder Scrolls Online, to Terra Rising and other such things. If I had to choose a favorite, I'd probably go with the Elder Scrolls Online playthrough, but believe me when I say that all of the series on our channel are really high quality, and as such Tamara Leal is definitely a YouTuber worth checking out. The next person I'd like to give a shout out to on this episode of Shout Out Sunday is a YouTuber by the name of System Freeze. And the first thing you guys need to know about Freeze is that he's potentially the most talented editor I have ever seen on YouTube, period. As I've said before, editing your videos and adding in little details while editing is something very difficult to do, but believe me when I say that this guy does it phenomenally, and the edits that he makes are hilarious. In terms of pure entertainment value, there's nobody better on YouTube than System Freeze, folks. Now with regards to the specific content on System Freeze's channel, he does things that range from Alien vs Predator, to Clash of Clans, to Fallout New Vegas, Borderlands, and much more. Each and every one of this series has been an absolute pleasure to watch, and as such, I highly recommend checking out System Freeze's channel. Fourth up on the shout list for this week's episode is a YouTuber known as King Sizzle C, who believe it or not guys is yet another non-gaming channel. That's right guys, in back to back weeks, we've got two people who have won shoutouts that don't actually do gaming content. But anyways, King Sizzle C is a phenomenal YouTuber guys. He focuses mainly on content pertaining to card games such as Yu-Gi-Oh, Pokemon, Vanguard, and stuff of that nature, What for me is a really nice change of pace from the gaming videos that I usually tend to watch. Furthermore, the guy is just an awesome commentator in general and brings a ton of enthusiasm to all all of his videos. 
Now, as for the specific content on his channel, as I said, King tends to focus on card game videos, so stuff like deck profiling, pack openings, deck analyses, and many more. But even if you're not interested in card games, I still recommend checking out his channel because he's just a talent as a YouTuber in general. So, folks, King Still is a really unique and awesome YouTuber, and as such, I highly recommend checking his channel out. Finally, the last person I want to give a shout out to on this episode of Shout Out Sunday is a YouTuber by the name of Jabberin Magpie. And the first thing I gotta tell you about Magpie's channel is that he is a phenomenal commentator. Good commentary can be hard to comment on YouTube sometimes, but this guy seriously does a phenomenal job as an orator, which definitely isn't something that you find every day. He also is quite clearly a very hard worker, which is evident by his focus on little details while editing, his thumbnails, and stuff of that nature in his videos. With regards to specific content, Magpie does a pretty good variety of games, including stuff like Darkest Dungeon, Fallout New Vegas, and my personal favorite, a Shadowrun LP, which is a game I'd actually never seen before coming to his channel. And as such guys, Jabber and Magpie is an awesome YouTuber, and I highly recommend giving his channel a look. Alright, and with that, folks, I think it's about time to bring this episode of Shout Sunday to a close. As always, if you enjoyed, be sure to drop a like down below and subscribe for more Shout Sunday videos in the future. And also, as always, I want to thank you guys so much for your support on the series. It really blows me away just how awesome and positive all of you are down in the comments, so you definitely have my thanks for that. But otherwise, thanks once again for watching, and I will see you in my next video.